Natalie and today I'm going to teach you how to get started on making friendship bracelets. Let's go! I will explain how to make two different patterns and how to do basically all bracelets with these two basic knots. You'll first need some string. I usually get it from Amazon or a local craft store. And I cut it to be as long as both of my arms spread out. You'll also need a water bottle to tie it to, or you can tape the string to a table. I fold mine in half and create a knot to get it attached to the water bottle. I tie the knot by folding the top over the lower section of the string to create a loop, and I pull the top end through the middle. To put it on the water bottle, I put it through the loop on the bottle and put the end of the string through the knot loop and pull it through. The first bracelet that I am teaching you to make is called the Chinese staircase and it looks like this. This only uses one knot, which is called the forwards four. To create the knot, I take one string away from the rest and make a four over all of them. Then you take the end of the string through the center of the four and pull it tight against the other strings. Then you will pull it up until you make the knot. You repeat this again and again to make the bracelet. And to change colors, you just drop the string that you were using before and pick another one and make the forward four knots with this string. I'm just going to continue with this one. If I'm going too fast, feel free to rewind or slow down my steps. To create the spiral effect, pull the knots to the side that you want to have the knots wrap around. Practice, practice, because practice makes perfect. And the more you do it, the better you'll get. Now, I will teach you how to do a backwards knot. It can be used in other bracelets, such as a chevron or the V pattern. I will teach you how to make other patterns using this knot in later videos. I started off by creating one line of candy stripe, so now I can go backwards. Now, you take the last and second to last strings and put the others to the side. To do a backwards four knot, you create a backwards four shape with the last string like this. And this is over the second to last string. Then you take the end of the string and pull it under and through the four and pull it up to make the knot. I'll do it two more times. So you make the four, Pull it through, and then you repeat that. Last one. And this is what the final backwards knot looks like. Happy Fourth of July! I'm going to teach you how to make two different types of friendship bracelet patterns. I'm super excited, so let's get started. This is the first pattern that I will teach you. I'm choosing the colors red, white, and blue, especially for the holiday. Take the first two strings away from the others. Then, take the first string and do a forwards four knot on the second, like this. Now, take the second string and do a backwards four knot on top of the first. And that's all you have to do to create these knots. So put the first string to the side and repeat this with the third and second string. Using the second on top, create a forward four and then take the third and do a backwards four on top of the second.
continue these knots to the end of the row. And when you reach the end, go back to the left side or the front and repeat these steps. Feel free to rewatch these steps if you are still confused. This is the second pattern I will teach you for the 4th of July bracelets. It's very similar to the first, but it goes back and forth as you can see instead of just to the right. I'm going to finish this row to the right before turning around. To remind you, I do a forwards four on the red using the white then a backwards four on the white using the red. And I repeat this with the next string. Now, at the end of the row, I will reverse my steps. So I do a backwards four using the last string on the second to last, then do a forwards four on the last one using the second to last string. Now you repeat this and do a backwards four and a forwards four. And you continue this down to the end of the row and turn around again. When going to the right, you do a forwards four then a backwards four, and then when going to the left, you do a backwards four and a forwards four. Thanks for watching! I hope you enjoyed my tutorial and you try out one of these bracelets. Happy Fourth of July!